<laughs> getting 12 here. We're so, I mean, if he has any heals, we obviously lose on the spot. Otherwise, final mission will get it done. So, three and four, just to be able to put two minions on the- Oh! Yes, we win against heal, too! Top deck madness! Oh, we were almost for sure gonna lose that game. I mean, just a taco, just a little buddy would have won. Making content for you guys is a full-time job, and it's only possible with your support. Click the link in the description to join my Patreon for access to exclusive streams, deep fry podcasts, private video calls, and more. What's going on, everybody? This is Fry. So back due to popular demand, we are doing the Patreon-only stream challenge where I start off with a fine deck. Today we're doing Valtrickster Hybrid. And after every single game, the Patreon members watching the stream will be able to change slash sabotage the deck. Maybe they'll make it better. Who knows? But, uh, yep, we're going to be doing Falkrixter Hybrid. It is definitely a deck that is easy <laughs> to mess up because I feel like the deck list is uh, very precise. I sort of got rid of, like, Trapper Territories, which sometimes I run. Just added a fourth copy of Mustache Monument and uh, Final Mission. And, uh, yep, so I'm going to play the first game with the raw deck, and then I'm going to be using the picker wheel to decide who is going to be able to change one card at a time. Uh, it's going to be all four copies of one card, turning it into four copies of another. Uh, I guess I'm going to try to mulligan for a Valk or a Trickster here. Got a Valk. Bungie against Citra. I think with Valk in hands, we'll mulligan that up here. All right, guys, I'm ready. Foul Trickster Hybrid. Uh, Eureka's nice. It'll it usually just gives you three small minions. That's most of the cards in this game. We got two medium minions and an environment. Nice to get an environment just in case. So it'll be beam me up. Yorick's here. Welcome, Yorick. And where does this go? I guess Grand. Just spam, man. You don't feel bad spamming with this deck. For those of you who haven't seen me play Valks during a while, because if you can get them their health down and then proc their block, that is... I kind of like the Kite Flyer here. That's how you're gonna... That's how you're gonna win. It, it makes the Valk and the Trickster need to be a lot less... A lot less carry. That's weird. Are we gonna see Admiral Navy being, like, Cycle Cap? Against the Citron. Uh, yep, we don't. There's no delay. Don't have to worry about snipers today, since this is it, unless you guys are sniping. <laughs> so I think the Quasar and the Environment look good here. Pretty good. This Environment will take out the Admiral Navy Mina pretty well. He'll get a little value, but it's okay. Really good top deck. Totally clips here from the Eric. Yep, so he's doing uh, Citron Cycle Cap, which is cool. Are there any Guardian cards that would work with Planet of the Grapes? He's not feeding us cards, very smart. Really minimal amount of damage done, though, from this Admiral. I guess since he's Guardian Citron, he's able to run Sting Beans as an extra one, one cost P, or one cost Bean. Oh, Roy. James Perry's here. Let's go. We got a nice little crowd here now. At the Patreon only stream. Let's do it. Now, Roy. So, probably beam me up. And um, he hasn't killed any minions yet. Still trying for those. It's a lot of beans. Just a buttload of beans. Dude! Chill. <laughs> we'll lightning bolt this. Uh, Boogaloo Super is pretty good. We're milled. Uh, it looks like some. Well, at least one minion will die here. Gotta get rid of that. It's too, too much damage. Do I beam me up here? Or do I use like my backup dancers? The beam me up is probably the better card. So let's. I know it's a little bit of a waste, but. It does the exact same thing. It dies and kills this one one. Beam me up to two three. It's better. Uh, barrel's pretty good here. 
And we're at 15 health. We've already killed two admirals. Which is clearly what his deck is based around. Uh, so we could go Quasar. It could also just go Barrel. Uh, I think I'm going to Quasar it here. And I'll give a superpower just more chances to play reactively. If he... Oh, that's some health. If he destroys something, Shrinking Violets, whatever. First of all, it'll just buff our Valk. Second of all, we'll teleport Barrel. Dude! Oh my gosh, it's Amphibious too? Wow, that was a hell of a Navy Bean. That was might have been the best Navy Bean I've ever seen. Come on, man. Holy moly with that. I think I'm fruitcaking this one. I, I don't think he... We just have to stall the damage, because now that our Valk is growing, I, I don't think he's going to be able to... Uh... We have our Mustache Monument, so I don't think he's going to be able to erase us here. Like, do 20 damage now. I guess 18. By the time the Valk rolls. Uh, Barrel's not good, because we got a bunch of one-health guys now. I guess just beam me up and we'll go from there. Brainana's a little bit harsh. She probably is running Brainana. I don't know when I'm going to be able to play this. So let's just do it now. It's not a great trade against a one health minion. Oh. Oh. Should I just spam this? I kind of want to teleport this in. It's kind of disgusting. But on the other hand, if we don't play this, we're kind of milled. I'm going to just spam it here. To unmill ourselves, to use the four brains, which we're probably not going to be able to use unless we're shrinking violets. I think this is fine. It's moving this <laughs> into the environment. No, I don't and Jelly Bean. This will lose the deadly, unfortunately. This deck's cool. I like it. I uh, don't really have a good answer to that amphibious 5 4 Jelly Bean. Uh, we're gonna have to delete his face. It'll kill our own guys now. Maybe I'll just teleport the vampire in and we'll leave Indre. We just gotta proc the blocky. Okay. Proc the block, and we have Mustache Valk next turn, so we should be good to go here. And we're opening up our own lanes with this barrel. So that's awesome. It's doing a lot of damage here. One drop. Ooh. Final mission does open some stuff up here. Uh, problem is, if we final mission, we're actually not going to rock the block and win here, so I'm gonna not go for the final, even though that's nice and juicy. Proc the block, and yeah, that'll do it. I, I think it's guaranteed now, right? What could he possibly do? Imogging this is a deal, because now our guys aren't dying and we don't have a lane for the valve. Did he actually, like, calculate that? That's crazy, guys. That was really his only out, was mogging that barrel, and that's what he did. Come on, man! Now what? Oh, <laughs> he can actually win here now. We still have beam me up in final mission, so... Should be okay. Maybe I should have final missioned, like, one of these to phase or something. Okay, he kills his own guy there. He's only doing three damage now. I don't like that play. Mariana. So we're going to put this here. Beam me up inside. Uh, main part of this play is just opening. We're opening two lanes. Opening lanes for the uh, Falk combo. That was a great play. And it's going to be the classic 20 damage combo. Bye! Valk Trickster Hybrid, baby! And we're 1 0. Yes! 
All right, guys. So now we are going to set up the picker wheel. Let's add everyone. I'm just going to add whatever your name is in the chat. We got Cottage here. We got Yorick. Where the heck is Sandwich? All right, so we got some new people here. I don't see Abyss here. We got James Perry. I don't see Starge. We got Pudis. And we got... Icy Pepper Pro. Alright, I'll add Sandwich if they show up. What the heck? All right, guys, here's the picker wheel. And we are going to spin to see who gets to change up the first card. Let's go. Guys, please don't sabotage the deck that badly. Please. Let's try to win something, and it's Pudis. Number one, what are you switching? So you pick, again, one card, and you put in four copies of another card. What's it going to be? <laughs> Pudis just got done saying he wouldn't know what to, what to change there. <clears throat> Mariana. Put in Con Man instead of, I don't know, Final Mission. <laughs> you jinxed yourself 100%. This is just going to turn into a Bad Moon Rising deck. Come on, you guys got to pick quick, though. Garg feast? <laughs> okay. For what though? You gotta decide what's what's dying. Instead of teleport. The deck is officially ruined on the first shot. First shot, guys. I don't like it. But, uh, yeah, you guys are in charge today, so this is what's happening. We're running Garg Feast and Valtrixter Hybrid, guys. We're not going to play Garg Feast. You might as well pick a card that you're actually is, we're going to be able to play. None of these games are not going to turn 11, trust me. Matthew Zang is here. Hi! <laughs> You're Mata Woo Woo, right? So let's get it started. Uh, uh, I think I still look for a Valkyrie Trickster. Oh, it's a fine starting hand indeed. I'll add you to the next one, Matt. Remind me. Maybe I'll do that while we wait for the slow opponent. Oh, I gotta get the picker wheel off the screen. What the heck did this guy just do? Get this weak stuff out of here. It's so aggressive, man. Very Mariana Sandwich is here. Welcome back. Bro! Okay. Uh, so either we can final mission now. I think we'll final mission now, since we have two and another barrel. I could also barrel in one of it. 
Doesn't really accomplish much. I mean, neither does this, right? Uh, all the six damage will probably get blocked here. This is fine. And the next barrel is just devastating. <sighs> Come on, maybe I should have spam back up the answer thing. It also would have made this splash so the barrel would have... Oh well. Ow. Raptors, man. I think we just play the control game here. Down to eight or in. We could have gone phase for four extra damage by hitting lane one, but the Raptors grow. It's a good card against Brainstorm. I'm not gonna let that happen. Just need some cards. Got some cards. Awesome. We have guard face, so just in case. Flag, Zombie, Freeze, Backup Dancer, something like that. Well, Fruitcake if we play something extra thick. Yeah, Pharaoh, not bad. Let's see what's in the box. Cool. Ah, and this costs zero because of the, uh, the Dode. Because of Flag. We're doing pretty good even without the Valkon deck here, and we don't have teleport, so you only, you have to get mustache mining and we got it. Uh don't think we pharaoh quite yet. It's gonna be you plus fruitcake. Pharaoh just trades pretty bad against these raptors here. Let's cut one first. Deck idea. Pharaoh Garg feast. <laughs> Not bad. Uh, this is fine. Well, no, let's save it for an actual threat. This one, this 3-3 doesn't matter. It'll be a 4-3 now if we proc its block. Which is fine. Got another little dude. Falk is looking nice and happy. Did not proc the block, though. Kind of sad, because we actually have lethal if we proc the block there. Bruh. Uh, this should... It's a little bit tough. I guess I'll do it here because we have the Undying Pharaoh. It's just if he somehow removes this plus does damage. It's kind of sad. Pine Clone time? Feels like a Pine Clone deck, doesn't it? Uh, yep, but the little imp does proc the block, which means we win. There's nothing that could possibly go wrong here, right? Yeah, we're good. <laughs> The deck still works, even with two Garg Feast bricks. Let's go! And... Sorry, not sorry. 18 damage, Valk. 2-0! Mariana Girls. I think so we don't have, like, last time where the same person gets to pick every single one. Um, I am gonna... I'm gonna give... Kudus Wizard. I'm going to eliminate him for now. We added Matsu Wihu. I think we got... Oh, I'm going to go Sandwich. Add you up. I don't have Sandwich twice, right? All right. Me thinks we good. And... Let's spin. Oh. Cottage cheese. What's it gonna be? Da -da 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 -da. Cottage. Fromage cottage. What's it gonna be? Cottage. He's clearly carried that game, I know. <laughs> Zombie's best friend instead of beam me up. See, this is a legit choice. Very weak for the trickster, but... 
He's adding some some actual Valk synergy here. I like that pick. That's a good one. It also adds some much needed RNG to the deck. All right. So we're going to update the deck list here. And we will get underway. The Dog. Dog Trickster Hybrid. Let's go. Chompzilla. Uh, so I'm seeing Trickster now. You kind of want to build around that. Sorry, Dog. Dog is back. Guys, we're having Dog whether we want to or not. And uh, Telepathy's really good. We'll draw some cards. Get some more tricks. I think this is a good thing. No, no, no. So this makes a one drop. So you just make it on heights, I guess. Bruh. Oh, whoops! <laughs> what am I doing? I definitely was supposed to play that. Uh, so... Kind of throwing already. No, 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 no. Lily, really? The problem with the dog here. Oh, Bungie's huge. The problem with the dog is that it dies to the barrel splash, so we'll basically deal five damage to whoever he plays up here. And we'll bungee the uh, Lily so he doesn't get a second shot. Perfect. Wow, he had two. Holy crap. Gotta do this. And we have to do this. Hopefully the dog can take care of this pesky sunflower. Uh, so far so good. Despite our little mishap. Wow, the dog actually gives final mission bait too. That's awesome. Yes! We got Chimney Sweep! It's the dream! <laughs> it's probably the best one to get, right? I guess like a teacher or a cheese cutter wouldn't be bad, but no. Chimney sweep on heights, guys. This is a good two drop. Two one, make a three two on heights. That's what dogs should say. Dude. How can we just find a wish in this one? Mariana. These two can, um, these two can trade them. I'm cool with that. He still gets a 2-1. Who cares? Okay, now we get to draw cards. But first, let me play Quasar. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're drawing a lot of cards, guys. Shouldn't run out anymore. And we can always Fruitcake if he uh, plays a Gatling P or a Allosaurus. There you go. We're not gonna play Guard Feast, guys. We kinda give up on that dream already. Chomp, but that is <laughs> chomp chomp. Play, but yeah, that's I mean he only has one card left and he's got a couple of nothings on the board. Uh hopefully we'll get like a bungee here just to slow this down a little bit. Yeah, Trickster's already ready to ready to rumble though. I guess Mustache Monument is the other card we want now. One mustache. Out of these four cards, one mustache monument and one bungee plumber will do just fine. There's the mustache. There's not the bungee. Okay. Uh, so this is interesting. We could go for the win by going face with this. I think I will. Oh, it's bullseye. I was thinking because if it's not bullseye, then the trickster usually gets blocked. But now that oh, we're actually a little off. There's our bungee. We'll just do this for now. We'll do Mustache Trickster next turn. So freaking good. We can just fruitcake, fruitcake here, whatever we want. Cool shark. Extremely awesome there. Mariana, Mariana, crow. Just be in. Enjoy your card, bro. You're so dead. 
Uh, I guess he could still roll double threes, he'll still have one health left. Oh, guy could live. It's not over yet. Rolls a three! <laughs> Rolls a two! <laughs> Alright, well, this is going pretty well so far. Time to get back to the best part of the stream. It's the picker wheel. And I think we got everybody here. Let's span. Who is going to be next? Picker wheel's the best part, guys. It is Matthew Zing, otherwise known as Matehigu. OG viewer, came back, joined the Patreon. What's it going to be, Matt? Once again, you're going to remove four copies of any card, add four copies of any other card. Mariana I feel like you could probably just get rid of Trickster at this point. <laughs> if you guys want to manipulate this deck into a Garg Feast deck, like legit, then I'll have to play it. I'd, I'd get rid of Trickster as soon as possible. <laughs> no, no, no. Don't, don't, don't. Get rid of, uh, get rid of, uh, you know. By the way, you guys can sabotage each other. If someone added, if you don't want Garg Feast anymore, get rid of Garg Feast. You get to do whatever you want. Where did Matt go? Is he AFK? Matt! Matt! Alright, Matt's gone. We're, we're spinning again. <laughs> Bro took a bathroom break. Icy Pepper, what's gonna be? Is anybody still here? <laughs> there you go. Is he taking out the Garg Feast? You add in Gizzard Lizard. Interesting choice. They don't have teleports anymore. Wait, so what are you taking out? The Garg Feast? Garg Feast is not a playable card, guys. I would take it out if I were you. It's fun, but we're never gonna hit turn 11. He's taking out Garg Feast. Alright. Fine choice. Guys, you don't just get to sabotage me here when you get picked. You get to sabotage each other. That's half the fun, guys. Get that off the screen here. Let's update the deck list. Oh, this is looking like a good list now. Top 10 anime betrayals. Let's go. What's this? Alright. Here's the there, there's the beautiful deck. No, no, no. Here's the beautiful deck. Let's go. Uh, we're looking for a trickster. Got a trickster. Against Wall Knight. Nah, maybe against, like, Nightcap I would keep that. Uh, uh, we're gonna need some kind of base here. There's no beam me ups in this deck anymore. There's summoning, so that works with the dog and the fell. It's pretty good. Come on, dry, just regular sunflower. <laughs> I don't know. Too bad. Mariana. I guess the chances of Chimney Sweep coming from Dogue are higher than from this one, because this makes two drops as well. Snorkel. Returning to a pet deck? There's no pet synergy, though. You don't do that. Gonna get that Chimney Sweep again, guys. Two in a row. Come on. Oh, Genetic is so... It's basically a slow Chimney Sweep. Oh, that's so gull. He had no answer. Jeez. Jeez, bro. I think I'm gonna just spam the gizzard now. Just to keep the pressure up. We'll get Zookeeper from Eureka, okay. 
Genetic was really the the dog zombie's best friend has been on point. That's all I can say. I wonder if I go for final mission here. My gut says yes, keeping this this uh, genetic alive. This is gonna go a long way. Looks like it worked. I don't see any difference. Also, we get firefighter, so I guess I guess the dog is technically a little better. But yeah, that's huge. I took out a four four. Well, that's awesome. Also, Valk is rolling. Yeah, I think the deck and uh, I think this deck's going places here. Uh, this obviously goes next to the genetic. Now, like he got you know the weird catching mechanic that did four damage on turn three, but to deal four damage again is rough. And he Shamrock gets half of our two drop. Love to see it. Good boy. This is this is a really good boy. Best boy ever. So it's to block the three damage. Probably smart. Uh, so we got Bungie. We're chilling. We're chilling at 20 health. We have, you know, fuel. Let's see if we can do anything with this Bungie this turn. Hammer time. That's okay. More damage. Bungie will probably just proc the block here. Should I make him play around the uh, barrel? Let's, let's wait till he actually plays something that will activate the barrel since we really want to get our Valk going. Uh, okay, that's a little scary. <laughs> Heals. This is one thing that can really... We don't have any environments either. That's one thing that can really hurt this deck. I think now to sort of negate the heals, I think we're going to do this. Pretty good. There's also the fact that if he plays the Heart of Choke in lane 2 now, uh, it'll only do the heal one time. It won't go through the cycle, because 2 barrels is 2 damage and Bungie's another 2. So that's good. That's a great play. Palkin? Uh, he's doing all the explosions now. Uh, the cool thing is we can actually Bungie 2 and he gets no heals, so that's awesome. Wow, didn't really think that through, bro. Your cop cannon now heals for zero. That was perfect. That could not have gone any better. And now we should prop the block. No, come on. Okay, do we have mustache? Oh. Uh, I think I just spammed trickster here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure mustache monument trickster, he blocks both. So let's just do this. We'll have mustache Valk next turn. Dude, you had one job. One job. See, now in order to pull off Heart of Choke, you know, he still could probably do it, right? <laughs> I don't know. I think if he didn't have Heart of Choke last turn, he's not going to have it here either. Doom Shroom is perfect. Perfect. Exactly what the doctor ordered. Oh, boy. <laughs> so scared. He's scared of second teleport trickster. Well, it's not gonna help. We have trickster, which we do. We're gonna win on the top of the morning to you anyway. So we have two ways of winning. Do we want six damage or do we want 18? Let's do it right in the environment too, just to rub salt into the wound here. So we're 4-0 with Patreon trickster hybrid. It's going well. That <laughs> environment, that could have gone horribly wrong. All right, it's our favorite time of day. Pick them up. <sighs> James Perry. What's it gonna be? The power is yours. Mariana, Mariana Cross. Put an egg. What are we taking out? This is slowly just turning into Valk Valk hybrid. <laughs> all, all out Valk deck basically at this point. What are we removing, boy? That's part of it. 
No dog? Wow, more betrayal! <laughs> wow, I was not expecting this. Plot twist, you guys are not even removing the base deck, you guys are removing each other. Oh, man. Get wrecked. <laughs> You're a monster. <laughs> True, man. Doge was popping off, too. Doge carried both games there. One by making Chimney, and the other with Genetic. He ended up shamrocketing that. Oh, that was wild. Let us look. Ooh, there's Valk. wonder if this is too early to keep. I think so. And you can't keep two bungees. Hopefully we'll get something for the Quasar here. And hopefully we won't see forget-me-notes on turn one from Legrass Knuckles. Uh, not a good matchup. This was the, the hero that made me stop running just Valkyrie every single time in the tournament. Man. I wasn't taking the regular, like the, you know, the regular season, the uh, pools, we'll call it. Of the tournament seriously until someone wrecked this deck just by running Grass Knuckles three times in a row. Ended up banning it for the playoffs. I gotta open a window here. I have four Mario. I uh, play forget me nuts. What do you know? Lizards lay eggs. Is that a fact? Second forget me nuts to be extra annoying. <laughs> Y'all are lame. <laughs> I love it. I love how this deck is still Valtrixer hybrid at the end of the day. <laughs> uh, see ya. So far, so good. Guess let's uh, draw some cards, see what we can get here. Yeah, there's not a lot of things to activate the Quades. Well, I guess the egg does. Maybe we'll get egg here. Egg Quasar Superpower seems like a very good turn four play. By the way, after two more picks, I'll reset the picker wheel. I'm just making sure everybody gets a shot. <laughs> Double final mission! Just what I needed. Come on, top deck egg. Yeah, I don't know. Spamming Mustache at this point. Mustache Monument. Hey, we have enough mustaches in this deck. You guys just run like a waxer. <laughs> I don't know. Probably not. Hopefully this won't mess up the lighting of the screen. Did that make the lighting better or worse? This, this dude passed. <laughs> Not third final mission. Come on. Mariana. Alright. We're getting it going here. That is not what the doctor ordered. Not at all. How does Grass Knuckles do nothing for five turns? Okay, that's how. That's exactly how. Oh, this is gonna be pain and suffering. We really need some minions. I kind of wish we had that dog still. Mariana. Mariana. Do we do it here? Because why the hell not? It's such a weird play, but it does draw the card and it kills us. So. Rockwall is not what we need here. Not at all, actually. So maybe we'll Rockwall lane 2, final mission 1 into something.
the hell? Ow. Ow. Uh, I think we'll do this. <laughs> I don't know. Gotta use those eventually, you know. Double these up here. Or just bungee. It's just bungee. Taking four damage. Need something good. We got gizzard. There's no point in covering that. Let's just defend here, you know. Bananasaurus Rex. Uh, Al. Just double final mission and call it a night. I think so. <laughs> Pretty sure that's what we're doing, guys. I'll take the, the non-sticky 5-4 rather than the 8-4 any day. You guys. Yay! The final missions came in handy. They're useful now. I think this game's so winnable. We got Valk. And now we have cards, finally. Eureka is so good. Small minions. Small minions. <laughs> Not really. Hey guys, look, there's some synergy to be had here. I think I'm doing it, because this is going to draw some cards here, too. Yoink. Plus it grows. So we'll just give this the Frenzy and the rock wall, and it's going to, like, draw us... It'll, it'll mill us, but it's fine. We also have the uh, environment here, which is cool. Ah, <laughs> that's funny, though. That's, like, all he's going to do. He didn't have another minion. Oh, wow. Can we actually still kill this? It does fought. Bro! <laughs> well! <laughs> okay. Uh, can we keep the duck stash alive? We can get it to... We can. Yes, we can. All right, let's do it. Maybe I'll back air bounce this next turn and keep it further along. I really wish we could have back air bounced that card he just invested his entire life into. But yeah, we're drawing cards and he's not, so that's that's a good thing. <laughs> I think we'll do it here. We'll cover the environment and bounce something. Or we'll bungee and bounce it. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, yep, add health too. Just do it. <laughs> I feel so bad for this guy. No, I don't. I don't feel bad at all. Uh oh, I'm so sorry for this. This came from Eureka too. There's no business that Brainstorm should have Backyard Bounce, the perfect card there for negating all those very steep investments he's made. Yes, we have finishers now. Oh, this is so good. Kind of wild. I guess we just do this. Actually, we can go Mustache Monument with it. It's not bad. Should we get the, uh, 3-6? Eh, it's kind of fun. I think the Mustache with the Valk is going to be better. Maybe not, though. Alright, let's just do it like this. Yo, wizard, Harry. Oh, I forgot about King. Should I have just spammed King there? Probably. Better than doing the environment, right? Yeah, I should have spammed King. King and wizard. Exactly, guys. Game of Dungeons and Dragons. All of a sudden. I think we got this guy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Dang, we're, we're kicking some tushy here. No bad. Yeah. What the hell did this guy just do? He rumbled. That's exactly what he did. Root wall would be pretty good here. It'll prevent lethal. God damn it. Gosh darn, gosh diggity darn it. 
Uh, just spam one of our Valks. Mariana. Mary. <laughs> Trades pretty well. Checks out. Uh, King me dog. Yeah. No need to screw around here. Dude's got one card. We win in these two lanes, so if it's removal, we win on the spot. Uh, I think it's safe to say 5-0, and guys. <laughs> Espresso Fiesta? You're right. Es uh, you're right. Espresso will win. He'll draw a bunch of cards from it, too. It's got to be exactly Espresso Fiesta. He'll take five and he'll do he'll do exactly ten, and we have to not block too. Bro, no, you don't have it. Actually, it'll be five, five, yeah, five, and then attack phase. He just threw his phone into a lake. Five grass knuckles. Wow, I can't believe we beat that Onion Rings deck. We were so slow. It was actually top decking three final missions that kept us into the in the game, guys. Killing everything. Two, well, two Onion Ring cards and a Banana Sorcerer Rex. Got him. Oh, whoops. Picker Wheel. I almost forgot. Picker Wheel. It's either Yorick or Samich. You guys have been waiting patiently. Thanks for your support, guys. Oh! Oh, okay. Here comes the cheese now. It's sandwich time. And then he sandwiched all over the screen. What's it gonna be? <laughs> you here? <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna spin one more time. Next next game. Come on, make up your mind. Take out mustache monument. Goodbye, deck. Put in thinking cap. Okay. You know what? As much as I hate that choice, because it makes our win... We have no teleport, and we have no mustache monument. So Valk doesn't work at all. Trickster does six damage now. As much as that ruins the deck, thinking cap's kind of cool. Maybe we'll get teleportation station from thinking cap. Maybe that'll happen. Take out fruitcake. Oh, boy. What are we putting in? Put in cake explosion. <laughs> Why? Why that doesn't <laughs> Alright, we have extra final missions, it'll be fine. Overall better, exactly, guys. Now is the time where you guys really start sabotaging the deck. You look at the score, it's a six and oh. Not having any of that. Now it's time for some bullshit. You guys are going to put in all F-tier cards now. <laughs> Come on. Alright, we have the cake. We have a totally dysfunctional Trickster Valk deck. I don't even know how. Okay, I'll keep the cake here for the Trickster. Why not? It'll give us, keep us card advantage, yeah. Four, four cost, four damage. Perfect ratio. Bungie Plumber is two damage for one cost. Just think about it like that. Maria. <laughs> this deck could still probably win. We still don't... You don't understand. That guy conceded against... He didn't know that how much garbage we were running. We do not have a way... Especially with Fruitcake on. Like, at least before we were able to play Valk and Fruitcake, whatever they chump it with. But now we don't have that. Now it's turn eight, Valk, and just pray to God, Explosion is able to get it done. Guys, we need Teleport or Mustache Monument or something, guys. If I get picked, I'm going full John Wick since they removed my dog. <laughs> All right. Hello, okay. Not gonna count that one. Whoa. 
Wall Knight. Let's go. No, K Explosion's not a good card, guys. We have no way to... We can't do Valk Fruitcake anymore. It's such a bad idea. Uh, I, We basically need our barrels to win, so let's just... I don't know, man. The, I think the best card right now in the deck is just Captain Deadbeard. <laughs> please get to attack. Please, please, please. Oh, okay. Uh, let's not spam that. Teacher's cool. Mariana, Mariana Cross. I'd love to top deck a Valk. Actually, no, Valk's garbage. Valk Cake on turn 8 is the play, guys. Or Valk Final Mission. <laughs> uh, we have two final missions now, so let's use one at a time. Dude, not like this! <laughs> Hold on, how do, we, how do we do this? This does five. Uh, yeah. How about no? <laughs> the perfect answer to what we're trying to do here. Alright, come on, deadly. Come on, deadly. Come on, deadly. Oh! Okay. Okay. <laughs> He's like, no. I don't care. There's no point in final missioning anymore, right? But we are going to be able to chop this. The chop was very good from Quasar. Good boy. So we can barrel, final mission, face, chop is the play. This will look like a desperation play, and we got Valk just in the nick of time. Uh, it's also heal? Um, it's a little... I mean, we could just bungee here. No, final mission chop is the play. We'll hit this. The, I wish I could just bungee this and also kill this this time. Goodbye. Get chopped. There's no way for the Valk to hit me. <laughs> okay, guys, we have cake. The, the second final mission will actually go well with the backup dancers here. Kind of like it. Dude! Ease up a little bit. So he did the exact same thing. Uh, yeah. There's no need to kill our dead beard. We'll kill this with either final mission or cake next turn. Keep the dead beard alive. That's cool. So thinking cap plus guys plus the final looks good. We'll see what's in the box here. Dude, you're a little bit late to the party. Just, just a little late. Ah, uh, it's like this to keep this alive. A little bit late. Double deadly. I need one more barrel here. Aha. That was not good. Uh, like that, like that. So we can cake this one. So it's just deadly and we'll see what we get. Probably cake. Ow. Can we sign good please? Uh um, more chops. Okay. We're taking a lot of heat here. Maybe it's just going to be Valk plus Cheese in lane 4 next turn. Spike Wee Sector doesn't really matter. Yummy, yummy, yummy. With the summit, summoning's really good here. I like it. So we're going to go for the win with Valk. We'll see Cop Cannons this or Shamrock is it. Should be good to go. Should be good to go. Should be good to go. Whoa, whoa. 
Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. Uh, and then final mission next turn, I guess. We gotta get the 12 damage in here, though, right? I remember, I remember when. I remember when I lost my mind. Uh, yeah, so Deadly would be cool here, but I'm pretty sure this is still it. He's doing... Oh. Yeah, final mission. It should work next turn. We have to get the damage in. <laughs> We're getting 12 here. We're so... I mean, if he has any heals, we obviously lose on the spot. Otherwise, final mission will get it done. So, three and four, just to be able to put two minions on the... Oh! Yes, we win against heal too! Top deck madness! Oh, we were almost for sure gonna lose that game. I mean, just a taco, just a little buddy would have won. Oh my gosh, Trickster coming in clutch! <laughs> yes! Alright, guys. So we got everyone back up on the uh, picker wheel. I have not seen Matt, so I'm gonna yoink him. I'll put him back later. Alright, guys. Spinny, spin, spin craziness absolute craziness it's gonna be Pootis wizard what's it gonna be poop Pootis is the one who put in the garg feet <laughs> come on mustache monument <laughs> oh. oh no untricks your trickster what, you're taking out Trickster? Just tell me what you're taking out and what you're putting in. And more poetry. <laughs> taking out Trickster. Bye, Trickster. It's kind of useless in this deck anymore anyway. Something to activate Valk, maybe? Teleportation Zombie. Mad Chemist? <laughs> <laughs> no, this is going in completely the wrong direction, guys. If you're going to add tricks, you got to keep the trickster in. Any more RNG. Okay, well, that's the story. Next game. I'm not even removing Pudis, by the way. He can get three more shots in a row if he gets lucky. Everyone's had their chance. dee 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 we got egg. Man chemist plus cake explosion. Maybe I should have kept the chemist there. I think we're gonna have enough cards. I just need to win. Go egg. Give me something good. You damn it. Fun police. Valk's growing. It doesn't matter that much without Mustache Monument. But it's growing, guys. How are we still 7-0 with this garbage deck? Absolute trash. I remember, I remember when. I remember when I lost my mind. We'll never know what was in that egg. Eureka. Uh, I think we take the final mission to face here. We gotta use him. Oh. Oh, we got a little synergy. Eight damage. It, it's nothing to scoff at. We have a 4-3 on the board, so he decided to just pass. I don't know what he's going for, but down to 12 health just like that. We have a really nice little aggressive card here now, too. I think I'll go for... We can final mission this if we need to. I'll go for, like, Bungie with Chemist next year. Just working with what I got here, guys. If there's a really good Bungie here, I guess I'll do that. Fairy Blast is fine. Why is he killing that over the 4-3, though? This is just stronger. Not only is he doing more damage to face, but it's defending itself, you know? That was really weird. He could have also killed that in two turns with the... I don't know. Uh, so Chemist is okay here. We don't actually have to bungee since this is a good trade. We'll see what happens. We could just bungee the Black IP and kill it to cycle the bungee. It doesn't really do much. 
I'm gonna see Pine Cloak? Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Uh, so this is a pretty good bungee. It sets up the I'm throwing in. Also gives us a little trick here. <laughs> Always get deadly after we commit all of our barrels. I think I like it though. Wouldn't mind getting a third another barrel here. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Should I do it? This is so toxic. We're probably going to see Molecule. I guess I commit this one too. I mean, we can also just final mission phase here. Yeah, I think it's deadly final mission phase. That's crazy, man. Top deck madness. We don't even need Valk. We don't need a damn thing. We'll also draw another card. Yep, it's Molecule. Come on, get some really good guys. Come nice big... No! Oh my gosh! That did not just happen! Are you kidding me? We have the whole thing! We have the whole thing worked out. Now we can't do a damn thing with this barrel. Bro! Bro, come on! <laughs> come on, man! What a fail. Okay, we're back in bed. We're back in it. Folks, we're back in it. We're still, we're still, in the, we're still in the game. We're back in the game. No more BS. It's gonna second Molecule here. Oh, that's good. That's good. Bro, you didn't do a damn thing here. I'm not even going. Well, the the deadly basically kills one card. <laughs> What a fail! I think we just go face face. I think we go face face and maintain the deadly. I mean, keeping block meter block meter full is good. All right, we'll do the play. I'll just get another one. Oh, we are protected. So we go like this. This dies anyway, so we go face with that. We could just win with double ones here. Yes! Are you? It worked! It worked! I don't care! I don't care! Oh my gosh! Highlight comp! Highlight comp! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Oh man! I remember when, I remember when I lost my mind! So we're 8 and 0. <laughs> Amazing. I maxed out my luck stat. Is 100% correct. Well, I gotta write down the fail. Let's go into the fail count. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alright, picker wheel, let's go. Should have done the picker wheel while we were uh while writing the the highlight. We gotta, gotta get into it here. Yes. Who's it gonna be? It's gonna be Sandwich. Here we go. What'll be Sandwich? What'll it be? Here's the deck.
Do 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 do. Bum ba dum bum bum. It's gonna be some bullshit. I can smell it already. Remove cake explosion and putting teleportation zombie <laughs> damage with an unexpected sweat move, making the deck about twice as good. The deck literally. That was the worst card in the deck, and put in a card that activates literally everything now. Sandwich, Giga Chad, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> wow, plot twist. Sandwich has the record of always doing the unexpected, and I think that was the ultimate meta unexpected move. I think that I think that was it. <laughs> Explosion was hard carrying. Now we can look for Valk. We have everything we need now. Yes, teleportation zombie. I love it. I love you. It's such a good card against Grass Knuckles too. So we'll keep doing them. He does not. He can grave bust, but he really just cannot deal otherwise with the dude. Let's just make this trade. Even though he gets two two cost three threes in his deck, we get Valk charge. Hopefully not second click P. It's fine. Oh yeah. Oh, this deck looks really good. It also like helps activate the barrels and the uh, gizzard. You know, the gizzard really wasn't gonna be able to get anything done, but now, now it is. It'll probably be dry gizzard here. So we can bungee up next turn. No, bro. No. Bad. Do I just gizzard here now? <laughs> I don't know what to do. I mean, I think I'll do it like this. And we'll gizzard on, on this next turn. And it'll actually, like, clear a lot of his board. It's also doing two... Yeah, it's a teleportation zombie. Should be fine. So we'll play gizzard... This is fun. <laughs> this is very, very fun. We la 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 and and this dies. I love it. That was such a good play. That was so good. Wow, he's so done. Look at his two cards too, and look at these bounce coming in. Oh, that was amazing. Yes. Thinking cap time. Yes. <laughs> that was so good. Uh, we can still play this at least. But that, he literally turned five. He played Forget Me Nuts. That means we're in such good shape here. Oh, we're ahead in health. Oh, it's so good. That's tough. That's a really, really tough matchup. I was thinking this is, these superpowers are so slow. That was so clutch. Excessively clutch. Cuckoo. Uh, let's see what we got going on. Trapper territory is so good. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I'll do this too for some damage. What a Eureka! What is happening in this stream, guys? Down to two health. We're not even gonna need the Valks anymore. This is just wild at this point. Aw, oh, should I spam a Valk just to just to like counter this? I think I will. We can also go three. I can't really do the thinking cab here. Let's do it like this. Wild. Lightning bolt. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, come on, man. It's actually called Electro Bolt. Fun fact. With from He just shamrocketed both of those. I love that. Dude is just trying to survive. Um, there's an interesting thing where we basically force him to get his rumble here. I think we'll do it. We can also roll one. He needs rumble. Nothing else will do. No, he got time to. No, he got rumble. Damn it. Just letting him back into this game. For no reason. In 4K. Oh my gosh, we could actually lose now. 
I remember, I remember when. I remember when I lost my mind. I probably should have committed another minion there, eh? Double blockbuster is fine. Waiting for those gravestones. See ya, bro. See ya. Always thinking cap them right in the face. We're 9 and 0. Oh. That was wild. Oh, that was crazy, man. What turn was that? <laughs> it was turns three and four. Uh, picker wheel time. Pick them up. Who it is? course for the last game we're nine and oh now right yes we are What's going to be, Pudis? You can give yours to whoever you want. Yep, you're allowed to give it to whoever you want. Samich already got a second one. Give it to someone who hasn't gotten a second one. Give it to whoever you want. Though. It's, your, it's your money. You get to... It's your pick. Let's see if we can get this 10 and 0 here. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Show the deck. You're giving it to Samich? All right. La, la 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 Justice for dog incoming. What am I dealing with right now? What is this? Oh, score. Take out Valk and put an interdimensional. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, guys. This is gonna be a challenge. We have won a whole bunch of games without Valk, though. And I think we'll continue the legacy here. All right, this will be the final game for today. Let's get right into it. <laughs> this is not Patreon Trickster Hybrid. This is nothing. This is nothing, nothing hybrid. This is all the elements of a good deck without the actual deck. <laughs> the hell am I going to do now? I don't even know what I'm mulliganing for. I have no idea. Uh, Mad Chemist, maybe? <laughs> so we can, like, get a win condition card? I think we're just looking for, like, Barrel Mission? I don't know, man. Alright, we'll play it. I remember, I remember when... I remember when I lost my mind. Not bad. Kinda wish he stuck something in front of that. Uh, we're gonna have to final mission if you play Twin Sunflowers. Let's just pass here. Maybe we'll still have the thing. See what we got. Dude. Uncool. Not very cool. Extremely uncool. Oh. That works. It does work though. La 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 I don't think I have to now that we have barrel mission next turn, I don't really have to play around the ramp. Very unlikely he has he's running Sonny or Shroom and not twins twin sunflower. He's running this ramp, okay? Okay. All good. No, 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 no. Uh, do I have any, like, is this a science card? Oh, this actually would have activated that. What a shame. A pity and a half. The barrel of Deadbeard is going to be the carry. I think we can really final mission whatever he plays here. Clear the Sunflower, go face for... Six, he'll have him down to ten, and we'll be right there. Uh, having strength also is very... The brute strength really works, because, again, we don't have power. We have no win condition cards in this deck, and this basically turns anything into some power. 
I think this just goes face, so we'll go face for eight here now. Oh! Maybe just bungee? Bungee strength and do the cheese next turn? That's what we're doing here. I could. Uh, we'll, we'll do the. We'll do the final mission next. Yoinkities! Yoinkities! Pretty obvious. We have the final mission stuff. Cobb cannon, but does it really do a lot? Oh, it clears both of the. That is not a good brainana. Oh, that was some desperation, Brainana. That didn't do anything. We're still fine. You're right. Cobb Cannon would have killed our entire life there. He's still ramping a little bit. Well, that's okay. So I think it's like Final Mission and Thinking Cap, and we'll do Barrel Mission again next turn. Barrel Mission is the carry. That is garbage. Please make that all you do this turn. It's fine. Uh, thinking cap first, because why not? <laughs> oh my gosh! We got two really good cards. The chop, I'll consider to be a really good one here, because uh, he's probably going to end up playing a dragon or something here. So that's awesome. That's four. Roll to one. Another four. Hell yeah! Oh, it's happening, guys. <laughs> it's going well. La 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 Three, two, and two. There's also a consideration to go chemist plus superpowers here. I think we just try to take this right now. Uh, let's say he's going to play dragon. So the chop will cost seven. Where will the dragon go? I'm gonna I'm gonna not play around dragon. Uh because we'll probably proc the block and then we'll we can final mission phase next turn for the win. There's no point in playing any cards here. Maybe he should mog lane too? But final mission is available. Uh, worst case scenario, he'll remove this and we'll chop. Chop wins. We're going for tricks against dragon here. Second dragon would hurt a lot. Oh, that also hurts a lot. Uh, chop no longer wins. <laughs> final mission. No, no, no. Chop's pretty good here, though. Is he thinking about playing another card here? I think we're still in this. As long as he doesn't get more dragons, we can do 14 damage. We'll get him down to 10 here. <sighs> Maybe I should have gone for the dragon. He would have been just chopped last turn. Probably worth it. Yeah, the Z-Mech Super is going to do a lot. I, I want I want this dead beer to live though. It also prevents this ramp. Dude, Rose, come on. We got a good game on our hands here. Uh we're not gonna do we'll do this next turn. Let's get the mad chemist rolling here. This is a little scary. Quasar is a great top deck. Awesome. Just chump blocks this, also makes it die to two plus three. Bats is nice. <laughs> we got our card to refresh. Let's see if we can pull this up. This looks like a like a Valk deck, so he's gonna be playing around it at some point. Heal is slow. Please no dragon. Okay. It's a good brain out. I have denied us some cards. And some cheese. But he's played two brain anas and a dragon so far, so hopefully that'll be the end of that. He definitely did not have a second dragon. He would have played it there, 100%. Uh, so I like bat. This is science, right? Awesome. So I like bat in one, lightning bolt something, and we'll go from there. 
Four, five, six, seven. We can play a lot of cards here. Mog. Mogging a one drop. Potential three drop. It's fine. Cap can. Alright. Okay. Whoo! That's hot. Oh. Wow, that evaporate is so good. It's the dream. The dream and ZMAX super evaporate. You just clear their field with ease. I guess we'll save the bats for later and see what we get here. Egg. We'll do the bats when it actually draws a card. Just working on that card advantage now, which if you don't count these sunflowers, which you should. <laughs> I'm getting good luck here today, yep. Still, 14 damage is going to be rough. Oh, Chemist is like the perfect top deck. Literally the perfect one. So let's do this here. Maybe that should have gone face. I just don't like him having infinite sun every turn. It's going to be Gosh. Ow, Cornucopia. Ouch. I should have spammed the egg, right? No, 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 no. These are pretty bad. I really wish I had spammed the egg, though. If we get, like, a beam me up or something, it'll go a long way. I play the egg. I like a minion, somehow? <laughs> YOLO this? <laughs> YOLO this right now? <laughs> we always do this. The speed rex is the only problem. Um... You know, I mean, all right, screw it. Oh, dude. <laughs> Got another card. Oh, I, if I, we had played the egg, that would have been a perfect turn, man. I'm just a silly, silly. Let's summoning so he doesn't get any more ramp. Uh, we'll, we'll do that after the fact. Should have spammed egg. Should have spammed egg. We will spam egg right now. Right now we spam an egg. I don't have to deal with this lane here. Let's just play these three. Codify it. Smart. Prevents our card draw. It's killing bat. No. It's killing face. Good play. I want to be ninja. I want to be ninja. So this draws us a card. I think we'll... <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, this is going to be tough. I would love that chemist back. I think we'll bungee like this one. We're getting another card from the bat, though, so that's awesome. Oh, you got a cornucopia. See, this is when we need guard feet. This is the time. The time of the day. <laughs> um, I guess we'll teleport in teleportation zombie here. Bungie, huh? Not what the doctor ordered. But he can't really play any cards, so we'll teleport in teleportation zombie here and just stall for... I don't know. We're going to need a miracle thinking cap something. We're gonna need something, guys. Yeah, this does not die. No need to bungee. Thinking Cap with some BS with just Thinking Cap Eureka is probably like the best thing we can get. Okay. Uh, Gizzard? Gizzard's kinda cool here. I guess we'll Gizzard here. Should I bungee this to keep the, uh, the dude alive? I guess so. Kind of a cool gizzard, just stalling now. Who knows what's gonna happen? Come on, thinking cat. Oh my gosh, chemist. Okay, so we'll teleport in the chemist. Rose will probably not have the removal here. Never mind. Oh, devastating. Pumpkin. Oh, God. 
I think you just hold that in your hand, giving us a late game card here. Maybe he's going for the win. He is! Uh, alien news, please? Por favor? Por favor, alien news? No! Okay, California roll. Three, two, <laughs> one! <laughs> Alright, guys, you successfully took out every good card in this deck until we finally lost the game. Congratulations! Patreon for ruining forever Valk Trickster Hybrid. No Valk, no Trickster, no fun. <laughs> that, that game was actually way closer than it should have been, man. Needed a few more cards. Alright, guys. That was really, really fun. Thank you. Uh, huge shout out to everyone who has joined the Patreon. Thank you for your support. Uh, especially in this economy. Really, really appreciate it. And uh, thank you guys for making such a nice community and a nice Patreon-only stream. That was awesome, guys. That's definitely going on YouTube. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. This is Try. Can't wait to see all you watching on YouTube in the next Patreon-only stream. Link is in the description below. Let's go.